A blood-curdling scream interrupts your journey. Cries for help carry throughout the woods. While you cannot say for sure, it seems to be coming from somewhere nearby. Follow the scream, of course. You rush in following the screens to their source. You stumble upon a hooded woman who seems to be lying at the bottom of a gully. Observe first. There might be a trap. You hunker down and stare at the lady like some creepy stalker. Funnily enough, you notice she doesn't seem to be in pain at all. Her movements are exaggerated yet fluid, and her figure, although cloaked, doesn't seem all that feminine at all. Come to think of it, there's something funny about the voice, too. It might be a trap! And it might just be a masculine woman. Hmm. Attack the lady? No. But I do want to spring the trap, so let's for a rocketer. A low, definitely unfriendly snort of anguish fills the air. She rises to her feet. The lady was in fact a disguised mustachioed man with a club at his belt. What the hell? I would like to hoot menacingly from the shrubs. Through, though your indecisive impression of a great be beast is less than stellar, it seems to be enough to break the spirits of the already bewildered bandits. They leave their position and flee. Sweet. We did it! Next. A series of low gurgling sounds in the distance attract your attention. The source appears to be a group of six trolls. One of them comes forth to talk and offers a polite bow. He explains they are holding a seminar for the betterment of troll kind, and that you are invited to stay and listen in case you so desire. I feel like it might be very valuable if this turns out not to be a trap. So let's stay and observe. Brothers, we stand upon a precipice of change. It doesn't get good. Well... They talk a lot. Oh, they're talking about the Lord K. Loren. And if I'm not mistaken, he is attending our seminar right now. Lord Loren, you must understand that this is a grave issue. What is your stance on troll rights and freedoms? Are any particular policies on the cards? How about healthcare? Give them the honest unbiased truth. They might be hap or happy, they might be very... No, they didn't want to hear that. But we got out of it unscathed. Let's do another combat. Defeat all your enemies within 8 rounds, 2 in a single ability, defeat an enemy while they still have shield points remaining. Okay, so I'm guessing one of these guys are gonna have a shield ability, but we can finally have all 4 deployed. That's fine. Yes, yes. Alright, you go first, Igni. I don't think they have a lot of ranged abilities, which is fine by me, so let's move on up here and do an enrage. Empower her! The heat is on! And I maybe don't think she's gonna be in range of anything. So let's put a turns on Signy. Super Zan! Okay, get back here and put a command on Signy. Take this and stay there. I feel like Kay is gonna be a support character. That seems to be his role. And you can try to taunt this guy. I will be your opponent. Blind and taunt. Good. Mana discharge. Oh, so that is their uh, shield ability. Let's see what it does, actually. Yes, yes. Skills and effects. Uh, so everyone nearby takes damage. 
and everyone else of their um, allies gets empowered. Interesting. So I don't want to be too close to these guys, but I also don't want to let them uh, uh, power up too much. So we definitely want to take one of them down ASAP. So maybe we'll do... Now I'm going to save the Blitz. So we can do our Amazeballs um, ability later. Which is the Massacre. Let's do this. Get her... Um, Get that one fiery amplicationed. And end. Okay, get over here. And command Signy again. These guys should move on up. Hopefully they don't get in range of the discharge. I don't want them empowered just yet. Or ever. If I can help it. And then I want you to get up here. Pinpoint strike. Wait, what? Oh. It's taking up four spaces. It's a big bug. And then end. Good miss. Now. We move now. Let's get massacring. One down. They seem to explode on death, which is an issue. And I don't like it. So I'm going to do one of these. And I'm going to move over here. And we're going to do Whirlwind. Might take a bit of damage. And move over there. So maybe I can kill these. Signy, you're going to take a bit of beating here, but it must be done. Good. Here we go. Down goes the small fry. Now I would like you to command Riffith. And then move on up slightly. Let us strike. Now, Griffith, can you... No, you cannot get over there, but this will do for a uh, start. And end. Ow! That kind of hurts. That kind of also hurts. On the prowl. But we got Signy on the prowl. So let's move on up. Right here. And do a whirlwind. Sorry, Griffith. It had to be done. And then... Does this apply to uh, enemies? All enemies in range. Do it. Ancestors! Hear me roar! That took care of one of them. Did that guy have shields? I don't think so. So we still have to do the... Um, uh, the challenge. Now, he has the shields. That's what we want. And if I get over with... You. That should take care of that. Do a whirlwind. Griffith, survive please. Good. That should get both the challenges. Yes, it did. And in for our trouble, we got a pair of flash goggles. 500 resistance, not bad. But more importantly, we're getting more resources. Let's equip those uh, goggles. You get them. Just because you can. Do I need to go back to rest? I don't think so. Move on. Defeat the troll! Win without spending any authority points. 
land all finishing strikes on the same character. Alrighty then. Now if I go over here, I should be able to uh, be in range of this guy. And maybe put a blazing barrier down. Can I move this? To like the other range? Or like... I would like to move it um, in the other direction. Is that possible? No, I don't think it is. But we can put a fiery amplification on him. Rampage 1! I don't like the sound of that. Ooh, no! Oh, that is a bit. Also, the rampage resets. That is a good thing. Do I want to risk it? I'm want to risk it. Whirlwind. A fine hit. Let's get dangerous. And I would like you put to put a blazing barrier would be great here. Like right there. Or right there. Here we go. And you definitely want a command on Signy now. Because that guy might go for her. And done. Time is now. now, I wonder, let's see what kind of abilities this guy has. He does a lot of damage. Signy might not survive. He has a swipe. And a ground pound. Ouch. Signy might bite the dust. If only I had the boisterous challenge, I might be able to kite him. But I do not. Unless I can silence. That might be a thing I want to do. That way he can't use his abilities. Undo that last move and move here instead. So you can use the Hermit's Murmur. Silenced! That is good. He shouldn't have anything to do now. Was it one or two rounds? I think it actually was two rounds. Which is great. I want to Whirlwind. And then I want to move away. Maybe over here. So you might want to, like, move over the uh, fire. The Ogre will. Let's get dangerous. Now, I need more fire. Will it reach from here? Ouch! That was not the direction you wanted to move. Do this. That rampage is gonna be trouble. Oh, please don't be in range. Stone toss is in range. Ooh! Best dodge of all time, and this ra rampage, yes. that was great. That was super great. Now... Pounds. This might be doable now! Insigni! On the prowl. Finish him. I should! Be getting both of the bonuses, but no treasure. I mean, it's good to get the extra XP though. And we should only have the one node left in this dungeon, which is an adventure node. We leveled up in the process. Might as well take care of it, just because we can. More damage? Hmm. Is it worth getting less initiative, maybe, for the more damage? And it might be worth getting more initiative for you. 
And it might be Brawler for you. Yeah. Get over here. Do I want to rest? How much X or HP does they do they have? Health. Does health regen? I don't think it does, right? But how do I see how much health they have right now? Can I not see it right now? Well, let's try it. See what happens. A bizarre scene plays out in front of you. What you assume to be a long deserted remnant of an old battlefield turns out to be quite bustling and alive. That is for a certain value of alive. There are zombies. They are looking at something else though. You realize what they're looking at is in fact another zombie. This one is different. He has a silly hat, so he must be important. Gentlemen, he bellows, our time is at hand. Soon the battle against Lord Relneth begins. We shall defeat that fiend once and for all! Ah, reinforcements! Jolly good, they say at me. General Igorsi at your disposal, Captain. Uh... I don't know what to say. Surely you can remember, Captain. Lord Seymour Relnif, the blasted excuse of a son of old Lord Relnif. Uh, Relatives troopers took down two of my finest battalions. I don't see any army. Well, he isn't called the Deadly Strategist for nothing. They're out there, hidden. How would that even work? You're dead. Nonsense. I am not dead. No, actually, you are dead. Your arm is falling off. No, it isn't. I have no idea what you're talking about. I mean, it's right there on the ground. Look. Sweet merciful gods, Captain! Severed arms! Just what is wrong with you? I need you to focus, dammit! This is a war zone, not a frat house! He just re reattached it? Uh... I don't want to tear his head off, that sounds very aggressive. How could I prove to you that you're dead? Well... I suppose if I were to entertain this ridiculous notion, it would be the way... Of progress in civilization. I mean ink and paper, documents, a death certificate. Uh, hold on. I'll be right back. So can I go back to town and get a death certificate for him? That would be amazing. And that is what we're gonna do. I think we actually completed that as well. I wonder if I can get back there. I hope so. Do I have a quest for it? I do! I need to get the certificate from the priests of Eunus. I hope in Eunus is one of the uh, maps I have now. Maybe. Is there a town in one of these? Besides my own? Not the ones I have unlocked. Well, we're gonna leave it there for now. Move back to town. And hopefully we can... Ooh, another meanwhile. You call for me, dearie? Mm, yeah. I could seriously use some help here. Ah, uh, not like I have anything to do. Shoot. Well, we still haven't sorted out all the family paperwork. See this? Gwen tells me it's some kind of ancient script. Maybe even magical. And I thought, you know, you're ancient, right? Do you know anything about this kind of writing? Maybe Aelis does. Ancient? Really, my girl, you wound me. Well, at least metaphorically speaking. Ta-ta! Oh, does he live in that thing? Hurt? Huh? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to imply you're old, even though, um... You are. Ah, when my age you reach, you'll learn that the subtle distinction between old and really goddamn old becomes extremely important. Oh, what's that? Oh, hello. How you doing? Grandpa? How you doing? <laughs> He's challenging his inner Joey. 
It seems there's someone inside already. What are we talking about again? What do you mean there's someone inside? A spirit, but not like me. It's cold, distant, asleep in this shell of an armor. It shouldn't be there. But there we go. Sometimes, if the will is strong enough, the dead may remain behind. And there it is. It slumbers. But I can reach out and tug at its essence, stir it once more, help it awake. <gasps> Are we gonna get like our own uh, Alphonse Elric? A spirit in an armor? Please do. Can we join or have him join our party? Here he comes. Did it work? Where am I? What is this sensation? He looks like a badass. Are these my hands? But I should be dead. I am dead. Am I? I refuse to die once. It's all so blurry. Why? Where am I? Um, are you all right? You. Who are you? Where am I? Explain this strangeness! <laughs> You're one to talk. Ghost. Yes, now it makes sense. Be gone, foul undead. You will not sway me. Oh my. He's adjusting really well, don't you think? Someone should break the news to him. Hello. Is everything all right? Am I dead? Eh? Of course you are, just like me. The only difference being that, for some reason, you're inseparable from that golden tin can of yours. Don't know why. What manner of cruel joke is this? Is this your doing, ghost? Ah, <sighs> dead, dead. What's the difference? They have trickery as a foot. Not really. We found this armor locked in the basement of our castle. Grandpa said your spirit was bound inside. Castle? Yes, sir. Escalia. In the Rash Till Expanse. Preposterous! That's impossible! What the what now? So you don't know why you ended up there? Come now, Mr. Knight. Please don't be like that. We're just trying to help. You seek to coddle me, insolent child. I am Lord Azalius Castellavant of Lordemar, and you will show proper respect. But... <laughs> Such a spirited ex-individual. I've had enough of your blatant mockery, Spectre. I will cleanse this place. Uh oh. You won't. My will falters. What? What is this sorcery? Explain thyself. Ho <laughs> ho! I made you move. Now I can make you stop. Are you becoming like the Lich King here, Grandpa? Not overstay your welcome, Sonny. Can't we all just get along? Sure, do that in your spare time. For now, I'm going to lock this upstanding fella in the basement. Let young Kay sort it out. All right, Goldie. Right, left, right, left. Yeah, leave me be, wretched ghost. I command you to. I'm looking forward to meeting him and hopefully recruiting him to our party. However, that is going to be a tale for another day. If you like the series, let me know by hitting that thumbs up, leaving a comment below, and sharing the videos around to get the views up, because views make the world go around and I appreciate it very much. As always, thank you for watching, I will see you guys next time.